All right, we're going to throw it to our women's soccer package That's now. right. We sat with uh, Miranda Constantinidis, and she's going to give us some insight on what's going on with their season. So let's check it out. All right. Yeah, so we didn't have the best start to our season, but it really picked up during conference play, and that was really important for us to get the ball rolling and be strong going into the, the conference. So uh, we just stuck together, had a, had some rough practices where we really needed to buckle down and get stuff done, and we did, and it's worked so far. Um, we all kind of refocused and coach was like, listen, like we all need to raise it another level and we all felt that from our captains, our coaches to individually and we really worked hard and stepped it up and expected more out of each other and knew that we could do better. So the upperclassmen kind of set that bar and the underclassmen followed and it's worked out successfully. For me, it's been really enjoyable. Um, I've been on and off starting in the past and to kind of solidify my spot is um, definitely something that is fun, but it's not ever really solidified. She's still been playing around with certain people, so it just kind of adds that next level to uh, next level of pressure to be able to continually perform well uh, at practice and in games. These next two games in our conference is definitely the most important. Being 7-0-1 right now, we really need to win the next two just to solidify uh, first place and to be able to have the conference tournament here on our field. That would be great. And then if we win on our field, it's just that much better. So they're really important. Uh, our tie, our last tie that we had, we were hoping to win because we would have solidified first, but with this next game or two, we definitely can. Overall, homecoming, I think, really brings the school together. To have alumni come and to the football game and everything that's going on really does uh, bring Mammoth Unity together, which is really nice to see. We're not playing that weekend, but that's even better because we can go to the football game, enjoy that. We're participating in the trunk or treat also as a team. So we're going to be around. We're going to do some fun things, but it definitely helps to have the whole school here and supporting athletics. Since that interview with Miranda, the soccer team uh, went undefeated in conference play. They're 9-0 and in conference play. That's incredible. Yeah, and the team has been on a roll and looks to continue their hot streak in the tournament, which they do have a really hot streak. And they're looking for their second title in four years. That's incredible. They host uh, the MAC tournament starting November 4th here at Mon Monmouth University. A lot of big games going on November 4th, so we hope to see you at at least one of them. How could you miss it? Monmouth Pride. Speaking of Monmouth Pride, we got our very own Steve Castanello doing uh, the WMCX board op for us. We thank you so much, Steve. We really can't do this uh, without you, and as well as our other great cast and crew helping out with the Hawk TV uh, production, which we'll, we'll thank all you guys at the end, because really, I'm having a lot of fun. I'm Absolutely. Sure you are. I'm having so much fun. It's the best last homecoming I could ever ask for. 